Hi, this is DH Dunn, and I'm here to ask myself an all-new question. Can I load 10 days on a game show? The idea behind this is really basic. I'm going to do a standard interloper run, but all my looting is gated behind trivia questions that will be asked to me by the beautiful Snowy Amulet, who has joined me on a Discord call. Hey, sweetie. Hi. There she is. And uh, she's in a soundproof chamber, <laughs> a.k.a. the room down the hall. And uh, we were, we had a good time getting this Discord call working. So um, pretty happy with this. So here are the categories. Um, 80s trivia for fire and tools. 90s trivia for food and drink. 2000s trivia for clothing. 2010s trivia for first aid. Anytime I go to a building, I'm going to have to answer one question from each category. And then inside that building, I can only loot whatever categories I got right. If I find something out in the field, then I will just be asked the specific category. And um, natural items in the field, like uh, rose hips, cattails, birch bark, those those are just, I can just grab those. And that's it. That's the game show. And I'm very excited because I think this is going to be a lot of fun. And Annie is watching also. I'm streaming this to Discord so she can see everything that's going on. She might be a bit delayed, a second or two. Now, it's always cold fusion and then what? I, I lean on Firemaster so hard, it feels cheap. Um, but I tried something that wasn't Firemaster last time. That didn't go well. Maybe I do Blizzard Walker because I do hate running into wind. All right, we'll go with that. And uh, Contestant Will. All right. And I'm excited I found some game show music and sound effects and everything they use during this. It's going to be a fun edit. Okay. I think this is DP. It is. I'm very happy about that. I love DP. Well known to be my favorite map. This is a good place to start for the game show. Uh, we finished up Miner last week. I think Miner is possibly the hardest challenge I've ever done. It's either that or Clean Slate, one or the other. Uh, I don't, I even Clean Slate got more days done than Miner, though. Miner only ever got two days done. So uh, I will definitely be trying that one again. I had a lot of fun with it, but it was not easy. Now, Koru taught me how to goad up this thing. But now I'm worried I'm going to do it wrong. I think it's here. I'm going to need questions as we get to the lighthouse. Oh, cool. Awesome. As soon as I get this little part right there. I used to tease Koru that I knew she taught me this, but I used to tease her that B taught me it, and <laughs> I don't do that anymore. <laughs> All right. But almost everything I know is either B, Koru, or cats, I think, are the three that taught me the most uh, stuff in this game. All right, so there's the lighthouse. Now, I cannot pause the game while I'm being asked questions, so I have to deal with whatever's going on. Can't feel my hands. Will's gonna get cold while we do it. So I gotta come. Oh to, yeah. Gotta come to a complete stop. And here we go. I am ready for my four questions. 1980. Okay, this is for fire and tools. Oh, I can't believe this. In Ferris Bueller's Day Off, what make of car belonging to Cameron's dad does Ferris borrow for the day? Oh no. The make? You should know this. What? You love this movie. I don't know that I love Ferris Bueller. Um, okay. Is it a Ford? Nope. It's a Ferrari. That sucks. A red 61 Ferrari GT California Spider to be exact. Oh wow. Okay. All right. Well. All right. No fire and tools. Nope. Okay. All right. 1990. Yeah. Food and drink. Yep. What is the current name of Auction Web, a company founded in programmer Pierre Omidyar's living room in 1995? I'm gonna say eBay. Yep. The first item sold was a broken laser pointer. Oh wow. Well. <laughs> Okay, cool, cool. I cool almost, said, almost said Amazon. No, I knew you'd, you'd figure it out. 
Okay, 2000s clothing. Yep. What comedic actor wrote a best-selling bittersweet love story published in 2000 about a shop girl in Beverly Hills? Wait, say that again. <sighs> what comedic actor <laughs> wrote a best-selling bittersweet love story published in 2000 about a shop girl in Beverly Hills? Um... Oh. Come on. Uh, Reese Witherspoon? She's not a comedian. What? She's a comedic actor. Yeah. Alright, well anyway. In 2000? Why would she I write that in 2000? I don't, I don't. Anyway, Steve Martin. Oh, Steve the Martin. The title is Shop Girl. Oh, okay. I didn't know that I guess all. you didn't know that movie. No. Yeah. Alright. Alright. Hit me again. And 210 First Aid. Yep. Alright. About which day of the week did 13-year-old Rebecca Black make a music video that, as of two, 2020, racked up over 148 million YouTube views? Friday. No. Yep. Thank goodness, because there's a stim in here, and I need to get that. <laughs> yeah, I figure you got the two right that you needed to get right. All right, so I got food and drink correct, and I got first aid correct, yep. and yes, that's lucky for no. this. I, I thought I mean, you sorry. got fire and tools. Uh, no, because I got the 80s questions wrong, didn't I? Uh, you need, you, we on. need a way of keeping track of this. <laughs> well, I can find it. You got the 80s or the 90s question right. Yeah, yeah. yeah that's okay. food and drink. Food and drink. All right. Okay. All right. I want to make one adjustment on Discord. I probably will edit this part out. Now that we've got you on the headset, I just want to bring your volume down a bit, a tiny bit. Um, yeah, I had you at like 200%. Okay, say something. Oh, I was too loud. Yeah, okay. All right, there we go. No problem. Well, we can redo it if you want. No, you can no, just no, stuff no, back no. out nope. and new, do no, new questions. Nope, 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 nope. All nope. right. I can I can adjust volume in... Um, okay. Da Vinci. All right, so I can only take food and drink and first aid. So let thank goodness I got food and drink because there's some cooking oil. Oh, nice. I, oh, I want to go to the lighthouse. I can't take this firewood, though. Because that's fire and tools. Oh, no, you can't. Uh, I can take... I can't take clothing. Nope. This that handy. sucks. That sucks. That that one hurt. That hurt a lot. No combat pants, man. That That's... that's... Can't believe I got that question wrong. I know. Steve Martin. And I like Steve Martin. All right. Here's my... Here's what I needed to get I right, I though. Use this. was this. So, I got this one right. Thank goodness. Thank you, Rebecca Black and Friday. Yeah, I know. All right. I'll just take... Oh, I definitely want to go to the lighthouse. Yeah, the lighthouse is awesome. Okay. There's so many great things about DP, and this is one of them. DP is Desolation Point. I just always call it DP. I know. I am slightly warming up. I'm going to check these lockers just to make me mad. <laughs> now, what is clothing or cloth? If I find cloth, I wonder what category that's in. It's not clothing. It's probably tools. Probably. Yeah. Uh, I mean, you fix clothing with it, though. Yeah. I'll look. Well, let's see. I know what category it is. Da, 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 da. Material. I didn't really give that a, a section. Oh, okay. We'll add it so to first aid. So I would say you aid. could take it. We'll add it to first aid. Okay. I, there's no cloth here, anyway. Fire and tools. Can't take it. can't see all right we're gonna head back down uh and next step is the probably the riker yeah i want to get the memento keys so we're gonna need to do questions outside the riker but i might stop here to sleep and warm up yeah you really should we'll see how much i warm up eh. might be enough to get to the hey riker. that's 
a good amount, but you yeah. have to make sure you can do the questions too. Yeah. Yeah, I gotta I gotta factor in time to do the questions. Let's see what the weather is. It sucks. Uh, which way do I want to go? Let's just go this way. There are a million good goats out of the lighthouse. And there is the Riker. If I sprint... Can't feel my feet. Will's complaining already. Uh, gotta be on the lookout for the bear. And the moose. The moose sometimes hangs out on that bridge. Don't see him, though. Matt's truck is over there. We can check that later. I don't think I have to ask questions for trucks. But if I find an item, I gotta ask, answer a question to take it. Like, to go into a car, I'm not going to stand outside a car to answer questions, because most cars so don't have cold. anything. Just but if I find something, I can't take it unless I get the question right. Okay, I did not get here before getting cold. All right, I need those four questions again. Ready? I am ready. In the 80s, 80s, what Star Trek The Next Generation actor also hosted the PBS children's program Reading Rainbow, starting in 83? LeVar Burton. Yep, we got Fire and Tools. That was an easy question. Yep. Okay. Yes. Here is your 90s <laughs> question. During a 1999 vote for independence, what Canadian province had a turnout of 93% with the nons defeating the... I have no idea what this is. Quebec. O-U-I-S? O Wees. Oh, you said Quebec. Yes. Okay. Yep, that's food and drink. Yep. All right, and here is 2000s. What commentator hailed Antonia Freeman's seemingly impossible catch of a Brett Favre pass as a he did what play? Oh, jeez. Um, Al Michaels. Wow, yes. Okay. Uh, we just got these. I should say we just got these questions in the mail yesterday from Trivial Pursuit. So I yes. have not looked at them. I haven't seen them. Yeah. Here is your 2010 question for okay. first aid. What fast food chain was at the center of a nationwide chicken sham sandwich shortage which caused widespread, widespread chaos in 2019? Chick-fil-A? Nope. Popeye. Okay. All right. So no first aid. Now, I actually probably can't do much in here yet because of visibility. Uh, I don't have any matches. I don't have a lantern. So there's limited stuff that I'm going to be able to see. And I will just remember that I have three out of four. I don't have the last one for the ship. I shouldn't have to answer questions again when I come back. Like that. No, no, no. That seems... No, once okay, you've gotten in these places, you can go back later. Yeah. Now, can I even find my way? It just up? counts for the building. Yeah. Um, I'm trying to find my way through this door. And it does not here to be happening nope there we go oh got there's it. the stairs got it hey dude he has nothing this is a bed check this container what i really want is up on the bridge frozen angler is a book what do books count as i'm gonna pick up the book so that I know where they go. They go into tools. I got tools right. So yes, I'll take you it. did. We are not warm. That's so worth remembering. Yeah, you need to we find a way to cold, start a fire. And we need to find better clothes. We need to find a hat and gloves so that we don't get frostbite. What I really want is this. This key. And there's probably nothing in this. Okay, get me out of here. On to the whale factory. Are you sure? Oh, 
Okay. We're fine. He's fine. No bear, no bear, no bear, no bear. I also love Desolation Point because you get the ocean sounds. And the waves coming in. Okay, so we are going to go into these trailers. And unfortunately, uh, I'm going to have to answer questions again. But let's see if we find something out here. Nothing in that. This is fire and tools. I would have to answer a question to pick that up, so I'm not going to. Let's go get the memento stuff first, then we'll hit the trailer. No bear, no bear, no bear, no bear. Come on, no bear. Don't need the bear right now. It always has flares in it. And flares are emergency matches. So now I can start a fire. All right, I'm going to need some questions here in a second. Okay, I'm going I'm getting to ready. this trailer right here. Okay. I'm ready. Okay, here you go. Here are your questions. For 1980s. Uh, let's see. What two actors known as the Corys appeared together in The Lost Boys and License to Drive? Corey Feldman and Corey Hain. Very good. Okay, and here's your... 1990s question mm -hmm. for food and drink. What Friday the 13th character won the first MTV Lifetime Achievement Award at the MTV Movie Awards in 1992? Jason Voorhees? Wow, yes. Me. Alright, and then this is for the 2000s. Let's see. What is the name of the little boy whose loopy behavior after getting laughing gas was captured in a video that got 100 million hits in 2009? Charlie? Huh? Was that, was little that boy? Charlie bit my finger? Little... David. He was oh, in the okay. backseat of his dad's car after a trip to the dentist. Okay, I do remember that. I do remember that one. All right, so clothing is out. Yeah. Okay, there's a wolf nearby, so. Okay, I'm trying. <laughs> a 210. <laughs> In 2007, what Bodak Yellow singer became the first female solo rapper to top the Billboard Hot 100 since Lauryn Hill did so in 1998? Uh, Missy Elliott. Cardi B. All right, so I got two out, of, two out of four. I got fire and tools and food and drink. Yep. There's likely to be almost nothing in here. I had to answer the questions anyway. Because you never know. Yep, you never know. Um, thank you. Could you? Thank you. All right, food and drink is one of the ones I got. Wonder if this is yes. any good to eat. Nice. Uh, what does spray paint count as? I'm picking it up to find out. It is a tool. And I got fire and tools, so I can keep the spray paint. I mean, I'm famous for not really liking the spray paint, but we'll keep it. All right. So as far as food goes, because um, I have the ability to make a fire now, I have oats, so I could make porridge, except they don't have a cooking pot. So I can't make porridge. Um, I haven't found any clothing that I was allowed to loot because I blew that question. Uh, that's devastating. I didn't get those combat pants. Man, that's that's rough. That is rough. Okay, so I think we can run over to the whale factory. And that's going to keep us busy for quite a while. The other option would be... No, 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 no. No, we're not going to make a... We're, I could have made a fire out here because there's a fire barrel out here. But why bother? 
Um, I did get fire and tools, so I'll break this down for fuel. Why not warm up? Because there's another fire barrel inside the whale factory. Let's just get over there. Yeah. What if you don't answer that question right? Uh, I will. Okay. Okay, you I, need, I need a food and drink question, please. You do? Yeah. A food and drink? All right. Yes, I need a 90s question so I can take these chips. Oh, okay. Uh, what British musician noted for his colorful specs was knighted by Queen Elizabeth II for his contributions to music and charity? Elton John? Yep. Never felt so cold okay, now I need a first aid question. Oh, really? Okay. Here you go. What controversial material was Lady Gaga's dress made out of at the 2010 MTV Music Video Music Awards? Meat, fur, or straw? Meat. Yep. Cool. I'm rocking it. Oh, no, I went inside, I went inside, I went inside. Hang on, hang on, I'm coming back out. Okay, I need all oh, four I, questions. That was a 2010 question by accident, sorry. No, no, that's what it should have been for first day. Oh, okay, yeah, all right. right. Okay, good. All right, four questions, please. All right, you ready? I am. Okay, uh, let's see. What two-lane road from Chicago to LA, a 2,400 plus mile avenue to get your kicks on was historically decommissioned as a highway in 85? Route 66. Yep. Okay. Okay, and 1990. Uh, let's see, what 1992 film based on an SNL skit featured two basement dwelling music loving dudes with their own cable public access show? Wayne's World, Wayne's World. Yeah. 2000s. What book by former fight manager Jerry Boyd inspired the 2004 award-winning film that stars Hilary Swank as a gutsy boxer? Oh, oh, God. I know this. I know this. Damn it. I know you're going to say it, and I'm going to be so mad, but I can't get it. Million Dollar Baby. I knew it started with M. I knew it started with M. Okay. That one's out. Clothing is out. Yep. What does the fan base of K-pop group BTS call itself? Oh, boy. <laughs> I'm amazed I know who BTS is. Yeah, um, I know. BTS? BTS heads? No. <laughs> ARMY. ARMY? Okay. It, stands, it stands for Adorable Representative MC for You. Oh, okay. All right, what's well, whatever. for? Fire and tools, food yeah. and drink. All right. Well... Yeah. I'm glad I got fire and tools because this is a place I might find matches. And I'm always happy to get food and drink. I'm very sad to not get clothing. Yep. But I'm very happy with this idea. I think this is... I like this. I like this. This is fun. Okay, fire and tools, so I can take that firewood. And he is slowly warming up, so I don't need to make a fire yet, but I am going to while I'm here. Oh, that's it. Okay. Now, sometimes there's a bedroll back here. Oh, and it's there! What category is bedroll? I wonder where it goes in the categories. I'd have to spend three hours breaking that down. Why don't, why don't you just... I'm going to get oh, it. You, why don't you just uh, have a question to be able to get it? No. Nope. I either... I, I had to get that question right. If it's, if it's tools, then I'm fine. Because I got that right. We don't know what it is. I don't know. We'll find out. It may not be in any category, in which case, I guess I'll I'll answer a bonus question. Coffee is food, so that's fine. Sardines is food. That's fire and tools. 
That is first aid, so I can't take that. Look up. Look up. Food. We're in good shape on food. Very good yeah. shape on food. hit the safe what I get out of this depends on whether I can take it or not four is the first number second number is something like 57 damn it I went too far four 57 Watch this be a Mackinac. I'll be so mad. <laughs> Man, these these uh two thousands questions are really kicking my butt. And twenty ten is just ridiculous. I have no yeah. idea on, on a lot of that stuff. Okay, what the hell is this number? There we go. <laughs> Can I take it? What have we here? No, I can't. It's brand new work boots that I can't take. And pork and beans that I can. I would much rather have the work boots. That sucks. Okay, we're going to do the fire now. Surrounded by snow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nothing to drink. We're working on it, Will. We're working on it. Cut me some slack here, dude. Oh crap, I didn't make a tinder. Shit, shit, shit. And I don't have anything to make tinder with. Ugh. Screw it. Wait, give me that back. Um, cardboard box. It's gotta be a cardboard box. There we go, it's right there. Okay, let's try that again. We still have two other flares. It's fine. Everything's fine. Just pretend that first one didn't happen. We have an 80% chance to succeed here. Flares are ridiculously noisy. We made it. Throw that in there. Go away. Put some water on. Give me a torch. That way I can see better. Look, another flare. And that is a fire and tools, so I can take it. Um, food can take. Food can take. Food, tomato soup. Yeah, we're doing great on food. Uh, would have been nice to find some uh, matcherinos here. Soda, peaches. This is just to make me mad. It's the only reason to do it. I'll drink that soda right now. You don't get the orange or grape soda on Interloper, you only get the Sprite. Might be matches out here. Gotta get that bed roll. There they are. Thank goodness I got fire and tools, right? Yeah. I fell. Damn it. <laughs> I fell through the <laughs> ceiling. Fine. I'll get another uh, torch then. How you doing, water? You're not ready. Uh, I can 
take that. That's fuel. Whoop, didn't check these. <laughs> Talk about nothing. Yep, eight jars wow. of nothing. That's interloper for you. All right, should be a mega torch. Could end up being yep. useful. That's a fire and tool. And that's food. Nice. All nice. Right. That's all she wrote. Grab that. Head down here. Calm down, Will. Okay. Let's have some soup. Mmm. Gotta grab that water before it boils away. Um, how much more time on this fire? I'm gonna go break those uh, crates down, which I can do in the dark, thank goodness. So I'm just gonna get two torches out of this. Okay, come with me. Is there another one in my way? <laughs> oh no! Cardboard box. Think about is food. Crate. Well, you literally just ate. Bedroll. Unbelievable. What? It is a tool. Yes, bedroll yes. is a tool. Yes, yes, I'm so happy. Can we put it out and sleep? Urgh. We can figure out our way out of here. Yes. Um, I don't really want to use a match. There we go. All right. What can we eat? Chips. Yeah, chips. Good suggestion. Yeah. Grab some chips. We have really no um, liquid, though. Peaches will give us a little hydration. No, I didn't know you could do that. Yeah. For that. Gives us a little. Um, yeah. I should have made more water, but it is what it is. Let's see what time it is. Uh, we could sleep for six hours. So I will. Okay. Um, we didn't. I uh, just checking something very quickly. Yeah. Okay. Uh, we didn't get that much condition regain, partially because we still got thirsty. I'm gonna light this mega torch. We're gonna go make more um, water. The nice side effect of having to break those crates down is we got a ton of wood from it. So we'll spend. Probably a couple hours making water. It's not exciting. But it's necessary. I really wish we had... Uh, if we had a can opener, then when we used the, the soup, we would have got the can. If you don't, you kind of mm. smash it open so you don't uh, get any from it. Right. Um, so we all, all we have to make water with is this little can. It takes forever. Yeah, but it could be worse. Sure. It can always be worse. <laughs> I mean, I just feel like if you were going to get something wrong, clothing, you know, yeah. you need food, you need water, Yeah. you need, you know, you need fire. Um, keep going. Oh, 
shit, I forgot to forgot to put more fuel oh. in the fire. Alright, well, that's the end of that then. Back to sleep. Okay, we are gonna head uh we're gonna go check the trailers, including the magic trailer. Uh I'm gonna count one set of questions for both the trailers and the magic trailer. And uh, then we will... Oh, look at that. We have some bad water. Then we will probably head to the anything. church. Probably. Probably. Eat this candy bar, Well, so that you can be quiet. Okay. Ultimately, I want to get out of DP now that we've hit... Uh, well, we also do need to go back to the Riker. Um, and I don't remember what I was <laughs> to loot there. <laughs> Uh, so I will answer new questions when we go to the Riker. Screw it. It's my, it's my, it's my thing. I can change it. Um, yeah, we probably should have kept track. Of yeah, that. yeah, should have kept track. We'll, we'll think about that for the future. Yeah. So I just got to We're burn. winging it. Yeah, we're winging it. Um, I'm not going to burn any time. I'm just going to go. Okay, so we've gotten everything out of here we're going to get. Never found a hammer. Uh, never found hacksaw. Never found pry bar. They might be here. It's easy to miss stuff in this place. Okay, hang on. Let's go upstairs. Over here. Check the lockers outside. If I find something, I'll have to answer a question. Hopefully the weather's not too bad. Nothing in him anyway, so it doesn't matter. Okay, so we're gonna be checking these trailers now. Let me make sure the bear isn't here. He is. <laughs> All right. Um. Very quick. <laughs> not very quick. Just go ahead with the questions. I'm ready. Okay. Four questions. Here's, nine, here's 1980. Fire okay. and tools. Yep. Olivia Newton-John played a roller skating muse in what... 1980 movie musical. Xanadu, which had music by Electric Light Orchestra. Yep. 1990s food and drink. This is the question. Sent in 1992, what was the very first test me message ever transmitted to a cell phone? Merry Christmas, hi, or test? Merry Christmas. Yep. Okay. It was sent by a British engineer to a colleague. Neat. Interesting. Is. Here is clothing for 2000s. What 30 minute meal star started the nonprofit organization Yummo in 2007 to empower kids and their families to eat and cook healthier? Rachel Ray. Yay, you did it. Yes. Got a clothing awesome. Question, I know. And here is first aid in 2010. Who played Annalise Keating, the captivating lawyer and law school professor who teaches her students how to get away with murder? Oh, oh, um, is, is that Alfre Woodard? I don't nope. think it is, no. No, who is it? Viola Davis. It's Viola Davis, I always get those two confused because I'm like, it's the one who plays Amanda Waller. Damn. First date is out. The other three are in. Yep. Okay, but you this, got clothing. This is the magic so, trailer. Let's hope there's clothing in here. Hope nobody needs. Well, I can't this take this because it's first aid. Nope. I have a bedroll. I mean, that's just huge. Most can I lope runs? I never have a bedroll. Okay, that's firing tools, so I can take that. Thanks for. Nothing. So glad I got that clothing question right. I know. Thank goodness for that. All right, now we go into the real trailer. That 
That is a tool. I probably will never use it. That's fuel. I can take that. As long as it's not first aid, I can take it. Come on, just do some mittens. Sewing kit. Something. No, you get nothing. All right, that's fine, that's fine. Yeah, sure, sure, that's fine. All right, uh, back to the Riker, I guess. Making sure. Trying to be thorough. Alright, we could probably check Matt's truck on the way. Uh, the bear should have moved on by now. I'm going the wrong way. I need anything like that now. Will, you're hungry again? It just never ends with you. All right, so I need a new set of four questions because we can't remember what I got right last time. <laughs> That's fine. Oh, I wish I hadn't done that. Okay, go ahead. Ready? Yep. Here is 80s. Uh, let's see. Which Candace Bergen character was an investigative journalist for a new show called FYI and later in the series, a single mom? Murphy Brown. There you go. 1990s. What medal did U.S. figure skater Nancy Kerrigan win in Lillehammer in 1994? Silver. Yes. Yamaguchi got the gold. What Icelandic singer hit the red carpet at a 2001 award show in a white swan dress complete with a long neck and orange beak head? Bjork. Yep, this is for clothing. And this is 2010. What former Na NSA subcontractor turned whistleblower is the subject of the documentary Citizen Four? Uh, Snowden. Yep, got them all right. Got them all. Nice. Yep. Clean sweep. Okay. So I'm going to loot the Riker, and then we're probably going to grab a save in here. And we'll, we'll wrap it up for this one. Uh, but let's take a look and see what we have in here first. We did a brief run through here, but we didn't have light, so it's easy to miss a lot. Definitely going to be some coal by the forge. And I will definitely want to grab that. Never would have thought to look here. More chips. Good old extra salty make your water go away quicker chips. Okay, there's a book for fuel. There's some coal. Well, okay, see. And there we go. That's it uh, for this level. Did I miss anything in here? I know I looted the guy. I got that. Mm. Oh, I missed the thermos. This will come in handy. I guess it doesn't matter what category it is because I got everything right. Yep. All right, so even though I said I wanted to finish, I want to do one more location if you're up for it. Yeah, that's fine. All right. We're going to go head to the church.
Maybe I warm up first. Let me see. Yeah, I would. Let's see if we can make a fire outside. Oh, we can make a fire in the forge, actually. If I don't need tinder. Come on, Will, you got this. Just give me something to warm up on the way. Come on. Hey. All right. Okay, we'll throw it. No, not the book. Damn it. Too fast, too fast. Um. How about the pork and beans? Okay, cook that. Put it down here so it's warming. Make some water. Boil that first, how much time on this? Plenty of time. There we go. Grab me some more water, please. The pork and beans is bubbling. How much time? 27. All right, and we'll grab this. Eat that. We've got our warmed up. Grab nice. two torches. All right, that should keep us shielded from the cold until we get to the church. Church has a fire barrel. The church is not an indoor location, so I will just have to answer questions if I find something. Oh, okay, sure. Now, I'm not thrilled with this weather. And I do want to hit Matt's truck. I can be a little bit more judicious or, or non-judicious. What is it? Generous is what I'm looking for with my sprinting because I have the bedroll so that I can stop and sleep again if I need to. Obviously not out here. But what the hell? The moose. Shit. Uh-oh. Where the hell was he? I never saw him. <laughs> oh my gosh, my heart. <laughs> Okay, we didn't find anything in here anyway. Matt, why'd you leave me? A scrawled message with a memento hint. I'm not gonna go do that. Moose, he's probably up on the bridge. That's where I usually see him. Maybe he'll ignore me this time. He might have run off, too. Yeah. He might have gotten scared and run off, because which way did he go? Alright, can we get up this little hill here? I can't remember. Nope. You're going to stop right there. Of course. Same thing here. No moose, no moose, no moose. Come on. Leave me alone. microphone noise there. Sorry. No, no problem. All right, we are at the church. So if I find anything so lootable here, hey life. bunnies, then um, I will tell you a question I need. Okay. Nothing there. Let's get the fire in the fire barrel. 
Really? Oh, we don't make dinner. Quickly, quickly, quickly. Ah, uh, he may fail this fire a bunch of times. Yep. Get a better torch out first. Okay. 40% chance, 40% chance. That's all we got. Um, I could harvest the torch to get sticks, which has a higher chance to succeed. Or we could just keep brute forcing it until we get one. It's halfway. Damn it. Damn it. One more try. I need to find some place to escape this cold. Will you use up my tinder again? Damn it, William. Now I gotta go find sticks. Astrid would not have done this to me. I've been using Will a lot lately. Astrid needs a turn. There we go. Okay. Oh, I'm going to need to answer a question for that clothing. I saw that scarf there. First the fire. Freezing. First make tender. Okay, now use a stick. 60% go. I wish I'd taken Fire Master now. Come on. <laughs> All right, we're going to get this one. Hey, all right. Well, thank goodness for that. Thank goodness for that, indeed. All right, I need a clothing question, please. Okay, here you go. What What curse did Boston's self-proclaimed idiots break in 2004 when the Red Sox won the World Series for the first time since 1918? I mean, that's almost not fair, isn't it? Uh, the curse of the, Cam the Bambino. Yeah, well. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it's a we're question. right. We're hey, that that's the one that came up. We are both uh, from uh, New England. We both watched that happen on TV. We made cookies every night of the playoffs because the first time they won, we had made cookies, so we had to keep making cookies every night. And then uh, our son threw up. I'll edit that out. Uh, our son threw up from that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, um, I'm going to put this down and grab one hour. I should have done some way. Eh, the water would have uh, evaporated, so it's fine. I'm going to take the save. Let's see where we're at. Okay, so we have inventory wise. Well, we're half covered. This is the only clothing we have added is this scarf, but it at least keeps us from getting frostbite on, on our head. Now we just need some gloves. Uh, we did not get combat pants that hurt badly. We did not get boots that hurt badly. Uh, Food-wise, we've done very well. And fire-wise, we're doing okay. Uh, currently, it is day one, closing on day two. We probably will stop at Koru Secluded Corner on our way out. We might not. Um, and then we will head to Crumbling Highway and then over to Coastal Highway. We'll probably do both Crumbling and Coastal in the next episode. Um... I really want to thank to find our food. host, our game show host, the Snowy Owlette. Thank you, sweetie, for all your help today. You're welcome. And uh, that's going to do it for this one. If you guys can do the YouTube stuff, like, comment, subscribe, those really, really help us. We have so much fun just checking every day and, and watching the growth. And it's, you know, in a world where everything keeps going wrong, it's fun to see something going well. So thank you guys for that. You give us a little bit of a positive energy boost every day. Um, that's going to do it for this one. Thank you very much for watching. Stay safe, take care of each other, and we will see you next time. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.